Welcome back. Sorry. What's our situation? Let's just say Shiva and Titan's little spat hasn't made things any easier. And? It's as you thought. The Crusaders have sounded the retreat. Then we follow. We're down a man, Sergeant. If we return without Shiva's head, our fate will be no different from Beast's. I'll take my chances with the Iron Blood. At least then I might die fighting. After you do, that is. I won't be dying. Not today. Then it's settled. No dying. Now, if you don't mind, we have an army to chase. How do they expect us to kill something that can do this? They don't. Only the girl holding its leash. The old trails are gone. It'll be hell finding a way out. Do you think a retreating army and their dominant will fare any better? So, Titan has knocked the fight out of our iron blood friends. But where are the rest of them? That can't be the main host. Wait. King Pat! Pizza! Our fortunes have turned, Sergeant. It's her. The dominant? Are you certain? The crystalline orthodox is a backwards faith for a backwards people. In the Iron Kingdom, they teach that dominants are unclean aberrations, born of blackest sin. Only their priests are allowed to perform the rites of priming. And I see many. We end this quickly. <laughs> Now, King Alan Scully asked. Let this be the end. Hey, 
this? Care to kill some iron blood? Gladly. White, you focus on the target. Understood. That's enough. Fully primed! Is she dead? I don't think so. Well? What are you waiting for? Bloody do it then! I need you here! 
Now that that's done... I won't ask you again, Wyvern. Take her head so we can be done with this! I... I can't. I won't. You would betray the Holy Empire? Betray? I don't recall ever pledging allegiance to your Emperor. My service may have been bought with this brand, but not my loyalty. I just fight to survive. And you think I don't? The Empire will have our heads if we return empty handed. So if you won't take hers, I'll have to take yours. I told you, Sergeant. I'm not dying here today. And neither is she. Let's find out. <laughs> Wyvern! Have you forgotten who plucked you from the front lines? Who trained you? Who gave you a name when you had none? You speak as if we don't bear the same brand, Sergeant. I've always had a name, and I've not forgotten it. Still clinging to the past like a torn blanket. Then you will die, as you should have 13 years ago. <laughs> For nothing, no one, and I will not fall by your hand. This way. Uh, Sid! Bloody winged. Well, come on then.
Hugo dear, my proud desert lion. Would that you had taken care when chasing the hare. I expected more from the mighty Titan. We put the Ice Queen on her back, no doubt. But you'll have to work harder if you're to claim this prize. My lady, the thunder. We'll be hearing more soon enough. You always were a fucking snake, Sid. Gather the men. We have work to do. Jill, is it really you? And who's this fine hound I see before me? A fine hound who saved your life, that's who. Torgal. Hey. His name is Torgal. You two acquainted? Well then, you won't mind taking him off my hands. Funny. I'd always pictured you as more the chocobo type. Clive Rosfield. Come now. Fleet as flame, fierce as a wildfire. That there was the blessing of the Phoenix. I'd heard rumours that you'd survived, but I never paid them much heed. <laughs> Calm down. I didn't come all this way for your handsome mug. Now her, on the other hand, she seemed worth muddying my boots for. for wear. Still, might be best to get a second opinion. Back her up! <laughs> Not another step. <laughs> I mean it. Well, I'm not about to leave her here. Not one with a warm bed waiting. It's all right. You're welcome to join us. You do want to help her, don't you? Uh, Sid, if we aren't back soon, none will have our heads. <laughs> I'll explain everything once we're back at the hideaway. Come on. <laughs> 